Welcome back to the Orcas Project. While I was in Punta Arenas, I had the chance to talk with one of the scientists, Dr. Sue Schoffler of the National Center for Atmospheric Research, and ask her a few questions. What is the instrument you use? It's called the whole air sampler. So we just collect air samples and put them in these little containers and ship them back to a laboratory to measure what's inside of them. What does it, exactly does it measure? Um, we, there's like over a hundred different compounds that are in the air that we measure. So it's a lot of different things. How many penguins have you seen? You know, I was trying to think about that. It's, there was probably, I don't know, maybe 50 of them or so. Not in Punta Arenas, but we went over to the penguin colony. How cold is it in Punta Arenas? It's variable and it's a little surprising. I wanted it to be a lot warmer because it's the summertime here. You know, you want to be able to go along the beach. It didn't work that way. Sometimes it's in, it can get up to, you know, close to 70. Sometimes it's down during the day in the low 50s, upper 40s. So it's a pretty big range. And it's always windy. Where do you stay in Punta Arenas? Yeah, we're all staying, most all of us are staying at the Dreams Hotel. Lovely hotel, really nice, right on the water. Where do you eat? Uh, there's a lot of good restaurants that are right nearby the hotel. So we generally, for the evening, just walk down the street. How did you actually become a scientist? When I was in high school, there was an oceanographer that came down from Texas A&M that taught a class when I was in high school. And I took that class and I absolutely loved it. And that's how I decided to be an oceanographer. Did you like science when you were a younger kid? Uh, yeah, I did. I was always interested in it. But that was the thing that really pushed me into it. Were there any toys that you played with when you were a kid? One of the things I really... I really, really liked was this toy microscope. It was always fun to put things under there. Thank you so much, so much, Dr. Sue. You're quite welcome.